Hey, Himanshu here from withhimanshu.com. In this video, you will be understanding how to analyze and track your website traffic. So imagine you have a website which is performing very well, but if you are not tracking your website traffic, that means all the uh, efforts you are putting into growth that website is getting waste because you do not really know what kind of people are coming to your website and what kind of content you need to create to grow that website further, right? So it, um, one of the things which I really missed out when I was starting up was tracking my website traffic properly. So uh, there are there are some free tools. I will be showing you what are some free tools to track your website traffic and how can you utilize them and see uh, what kind of people are coming to your web website and what kind of ads you can put in your website or how you can monetize your website, right? So most important thing is uh, when you are creating a blog or when you are creating uh, any e-commerce store or any type of website is uh, to really understand the uh, behavior of your users, right? Behavior of your visitors so that you can understand, okay, that person is interested uh, more into technology and another person who is coming to your website is more interested in maybe in shopping or maybe in um, spiritual uh, spirituality or maybe into make money online okay so uh, the idea is to if you want to grow your website if you want to make more money from it you need to understand what kind of people are coming to your website and uh, creating content and structuring your content in that manner all right so let's jump to my screen and let's talk about what are some free ways to track your website uh, traffic properly okay so make sure to watch this video till the end so that uh, you can understand how i am doing things and why it uh, it is important and so much easier okay so you do not have to hire any uh, freelancer to do this and if you are a freelancer you can find other clients who uh, who will be interested to buy your services okay so let's jump to my screen and let's understand this okay so this is one of my website traffic and if you can see this this is uh, this is my daily traffic right so right now there are seven active users on this website and there are um, 3.1 thousand visitors uh, have come to this website today okay so this is the kind of results i am getting on this so i can i can clearly see where how many sessions they have done and how uh, what a, what was the duration of it so that i can understand okay uh, people are staying on my website for this much uh, this much uh, uh, amount okay so th th this much time and then i can also see most of my visitors are coming through my organic search and direct referral and other okay and another thing uh, you can actually see is the country. So I can see 95% of my visitors are from India and some are from Philippines and from Nepal and uh, yeah, that's much only, okay. And I can also see that 93% of my visitors are um, using their mobiles while they are, they are surfing my website, right? And only 4.5% are using desktop. So imagine if your website is not mobile optimized or if you are not using AMP, uh, that is accelerated mobile pages, which is a fast loading pages, okay? So if you are not using this technology, fast using pages for your website, that means you, uh, you are not giving full experience to your mobile visitor users, right? Mobile uh, visitors, mobile website visitors, okay? So, and 1.7% are using tablets. So, uh, I can see my uh, my website users are mobile friendly. So, I have to create content which is, uh, which can be viewed properly on mobile, uh, mobi uh, mobiles, right? Now, this is, this is one of the things I understood. Now, also when I use Google Analytics, this is the tool which I am using, right? So, I can also see what kind of behavioral flow people have and what kind of site content they are using and what is my site speed and all of that and it is super easy right now I'm not going deeper into it because I have to cover a lot in this short video but I hope you would have understood this simple idea right now how to use it I want you to go to this a uh, link I have given in the description it's analytics.google.com so this is the link when you will go and when you will sign up it will um, it will guide you to create your website name and it will give you a small code okay so you have to use this code on your website so everywhere where you you think your web where your visitors will go you can actually uh, put this link okay on each and every website 
uh, a website page and you can track what kind of uh, people are coming through Google or maybe through social media or all of that. Okay. And Google and all these uh, networks have partnered together and they allow you to track your website visitors all around the internet. Okay. So this is the kind of really, uh, this is a really powerful uh, technique. Okay. And it is actually super simple. So uh, I just click on this admin button and I went to this, um, uh, this page. Okay. So this is my property. So there is an account and, and every account, there are some properties. So my one website is my one property. Okay. So I can click on this tracking info over here and I can uh, click on this tracking code. And once I will click, I will, uh, you will be able to copy that code. Okay. So I'm not clicking on it right now so that you can, I can, uh, be, uh, I do not open too much about my website right now because some, there will be some people who will be, um, who will go crazy behind it. Okay. So of course you can reverse, uh, reverse track if you want. Um, if you are really interested to particularly, um, hunt my website, but I, I would say just, this is the simple process. Okay. So go to analytics.google.com and, uh, then, uh, they will give you, Google will give you this tracking code. Okay. So all you need to do is to copy that tracking code and put this in your HTML head. So what is your HTML head? It's simply, uh, a piece of code. Okay. So if you are not technical, I mean, you can, you can actually avoid it. If you are using WordPress, you can, um, go to add plugins. Okay. You can go to add plugins and you can found, uh, find some plugins, which will, uh, help you to track, uh, track your website uh, traffic. Okay. Now the next thing I want you to, uh, I want to create in this particular video is Jetpack, which is a free, uh, uh free WordPress plugin. Okay. And this plugin actually, um, needs nothing. Okay. And it will simply track all the website uh, visitors, all the traffic and how they are actually performing. So what kind of stat you are getting, for example, today you got 1000 visitors and maybe on, uh, on the other day you got 2000 visitors. So all of that you can actually track the only difference between Google analytics and, uh, uh, this, this jetpack, uh, jetpack, uh, plugin is Jetpack plugin is very limited. It doesn't uh, give you much information about uh, what kind of behavior your users have and what kind of uh, uh, what kind of things they are more interested in. Okay, that is very important, right? But you can actually track this um, depending on wh how, what what kind of pages are getting more hits. So let's come to my screen and let's see this. So uh, this uh, this current website right now is. Um, there are, there are one zero five seven views, uh, today. Okay. So I got, um, I'm on this particular website of mine, uh, uh, 1000 wasn't 1000 people actually, uh, visited this page till this point. So right now it's, uh, two seven PM, right? So I can see, uh, and th there you can also see this, um, this jig jank, uh, jig jack, uh, stat, uh, bars, right? So that, uh, uh, so some weeks were good. Some weeks were uh, not good. And there were some, um, so last time there were some Google update, which hit, right? So many websites got hit. So fortunately I was creating good, um, content and I am, uh, I can see my growth is far more, uh, far more consistent. Okay. So you can see last week I got. Uh, 12,000, 12,000 views, right? And uh, this is actually a good one, right? This is actually a good one. So this is, uh, this is one of the stat I, I just wanted to show you. So you have to go to add plugins. So, um, just go to uh, plugins. If you are not familiar with WordPress, you can actually ignore this. Okay. Uh, use Google analytics in that case. You, all you need to do is to simply uh, copy that code and paste it in your head. Okay. You can find a lot of tutorials about it. Now, um, if you are familiar with, uh, WordPress plugin and WordPress, uh, system that, that is actually a free, um, free CMS. That means content management system. And I really love using WordPress. So this is why I use both jetpack so that I can quickly find out how many people are visiting. And in, a um, in a period of time, maybe in one month and maybe in three months, I can actually go, go to, uh, Google analytics and I can see how many, um, how, what kind of, uh, visitors I'm attracting. Okay. So that I can create content accordingly. Right. So, um, uh, once you will click on this add new, uh, plugin, you will reach to this page. Okay. So right now you can see, um, uh, 
there are so many free plugins. So this is the best part about um, WordPress. Most of the plugins, all these good plugins are actually free. And Jetpack is created by the people who have actually created WordPress itself. So this is a great, great software, right? I have actually installed it. So you can simply uh, click on this um, Jetpack by WordPress and you can simply uh, click on install now. Okay, so once you will click on install now, it will guide you to a simple step by step process which will help you to uh, create your uh, uh, create your analytics dashboard okay and you will be able to track all your website traffic and how people are visiting you uh, what kind of reference you are get getting and if you if somebody is sharing your website you can actually track that okay so i i would highly recommend you to use uh, social sharing buttons on your website and your blog so that uh, you can you can see if people are actually liking it and if people are actually sharing it on their social media profiles and that is another good way to get quality traffic okay because people love uh, things when other people share it right and in fact google will recognize the same uh, as a uh, as a hint that your website is having valuable content that is very important right so i hope you would have liked this video let me know in the comment box if you have any confusion regarding this give me a thumbs up if you like this video and make sure to press the subscribe button press the bell icon so that every time when i put a new video you can go and get notified okay so that's all for this video i'm looking forward to see you in the next Bye bye